Oscar winner Viola Davis leads a fierce all-female squad of 19th century African warriors in The Woman King. That's new only in theaters. They're out to protect their tribe and their king, John Boyega, from all enemies. Also with Lashana Lynch. It is more Hollywood formula than history, okay, but an emotional and entertaining adventure epic. Three stars. If only they would just die. Pardon? Nothing. Oh, then also new in theaters is Pearl. Prequel to the horror movie X from earlier this year, Mia Goth back as the farm girl who dreams of becoming a dancer but becomes a crazy killer instead. It's as good as a confession. It's not jump to conclusions, Constable. There's also See How They Run, a whodunit farce about a murder backstage at a whodunit Agatha Christie play. Sam Rockwell stars with Saoirse Ronan and Adrian Brody. Your job description reads coach, not pastor. And you got the faith-based running the bases about a high school baseball coach who fights for school prayer. Did they threaten you at all? I have definitely been made to feel threatened. Then there's some tension between Professor Tandiwe Newton and some locals in the new thriller God's Country. That's in select theaters and at home on premium VOD. Uh, so is Confess Fletch. Yeah, a new Fletch reboot. Are you Fletcher? Yes, I am. Oh! I mean, no, I'm not. I always get that wrong. John Hamm taking over for Chevy Chase as that mystery-solving, wise guy, investigative reporter. What's the movie gonna be about? It's about him working here. Otherwise, Kevin Smith's Clerks 3 continues to play through Fathom Events this weekend. They're also gonna bring us the new sequel, Jeepers Creepers Reborn. That's Monday through Wednesday. The line must be drawn here. Then you catch Star Trek First Contact select screens Sunday and Wednesday. I'm Batman. And Saturday only Cinemark celebrates Batman Day, a show on Mask of the Phantasm and the two Tim Burton Bat movies. Make a wish. What does one do with three wishes? Then going straight from theaters to premium VOD at home is 3,000 Years of Longing, the genie movie with Idris Elba and Tilda Swinton. Also, the horror movie The Invitation. And Breaking, in which John Boyega takes a bank hostage. We should team up and do each other's revenge. And it's on a streaming where the movie Do Revenge is new on Netflix about two teens who team up to get revenge. They're Riverdale's Camila Mendes and Stranger Things Maya Hawk. Also new to Netflix, a new season of the fantasy Fate the Winks saga, the movie Morbius. That's right, it's Morbin time. And also a movie called I Used to Be Famous, about a forgotten pop star, Deadpool villain Ed Skrine, who starts a band with a young autistic drummer. I killed him, and I loved it so much. Then Hulu, of course, just kicked off a new season of The Handmaid's Tale. Peacock has the new Vampire Academy series based on those books. What do you think she looks like under there? I don't think that's our mother. Ooh, and Amazon Prime premieres the movie Goodnight Mommy, a remake that stars Naomi Watts about two twin brothers who suspect that the mommy who came home post-surgery all bandaged up might not be mommy after all. That's a look at what's new from the director's chair.